Hey, uh, welcome to my channel. Um, happy Thanksgiving. And today I want to talk about this big turkey girl, uh, Cleopteryx, um, or chicken. I mean, she, I, I have no idea. Uh, let's get into it. <laughs> So this bird slash chicken slash turkey, she's the closest thing I could find that uh, reminds me of Thanksgiving. So I decided to uh, make a video about her. Uh, as you can see, I'm really close to getting her. I don't have her yet. Um, I'm waiting for my daily uh, login to get her. So I will be getting her in about two weeks. So I'll be getting Cleop Cleopteryx. So anyways. Well, let's just go over her kit. She seems like she's going to be pretty useful for the new Hydra boss, uh, I believe. So that's 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 the hype. That's the hope. Um, so she attacks one enemy, has a 30% chance of placing a 25% weakened debuff for two turns. The chance increases to 50% if the target is under a hex debuff. So uh, she's a great hexer um, as long as the hex or she's she's a great weakener as long as the hex debuff is up um, she also places a perfect veil uh, on this champion for one turn if it, it kills an enemy under the hex debuff so that's kind of situational so she has to kill the champion to get the cleanse or to get the perfect veil um, I don't know how helpful that's going to be for the hydra boss but um, I'm pretty sure that we need to be under perfect veil <clears throat> so Places a 30% increase uh, crit rate buff on the champion for two turns and attacks all enemies. Has a 75% chance of placing a block active skills debuff for two turns on targets under hex debuffs. So like I said, I, I don't know too much about the Hydra. Um, the, the Feather Barrage, um, the block active skills, is that going to work? I'm not sure. Uh, so... Um, yeah, anyways, so, so we'll go on to the third one. <laughs> I'm just reading these off for you guys. So, I hope you guys are getting fat today. Uh, I hope you don't have your belt on, so you can fit as much in your belly as you can. Um, so anyways, number three. Uh, this is our A3, Sky Spun Punishment. Places a 50% increase at, uh, accuracy buff on the champion for two turns. Then attacks all enemies. Uh, has a 75% chance of placing a hex debuff for three turns so it's like every move is a hex so she's always getting that hex out there maybe that's going to be her utility is just to always have hex on the hydra um or you know you know if she was in a regular team you know i don't know how useful hex is uh but i don't use rural that's for sure um has 100 percent of placing a fear debuff for one turn instead of on enemies under hex debuffs okay um, so she can fear. Yeah, I, I really don't know how well she's going to be for the Hydra. Um, counterattacks with the default. This is her passive right here. Counterattacks with the default skill every time this champion loses 30% HP or more in a single turn. Always counterattacks when attack if two or more allies are dead. I mean, I don't know. She doesn't seem that great. She literally just seems like uh, just a, a bird. You know, her aesthetics are pretty cool. Um, I mean, a bird in a bikini with a spear? I don't know. I mean, that's that's a cool concept. Um, yeah, I mean, she's, she's pretty cool looking. <laughs> that's about it. So, I guess we'll find out when the Hydra boss comes out. Uh, anyways, I just wanted to show you the champion I thought looks the most like a chicken, or turkey <laughs> uh, you tell me what you think uh, you think she's the, the best looking turkey out there bird hawk dinosaur I don't know Cleopteryx that sounds like a like a philosopher I don't know it sounds like a dinosaur name so um, yeah all right well thank you for watching um, I, got, I hope you guys have a great Thanksgiving uh, and enjoy the time off if you have it. I know I am. The next couple days I'm going to make quite a few videos because I have like four days off. So I'm excited. 
Um, uh, and uh, yeah, I hope you look at more of my content, and we'll, I'll see you in the next one. See you.